right, everybody, welcome back, and uh, good morning, well, late morning anyway. I'm feeling a lot better today. The uh, temper the fever's gone, and uh, I'm not near as hacking and, and stuff. It's a lot easier to breathe, so uh, life's a lot better today. So with that and it being Saturday, I figured now is the time uh, to go ahead and start laminating at least the first bit of starboard gunnel to the shear. So that's what we're going to do today. That's going to consist of me using my 1x2s over there that I have freshly ripped and I'm going to place them along the starboard side on the shear where I cut those notches. So I'm not obviously going to get it entirely done today. This is going to be a several day, maybe even a week or so process of doing this because what I do is I spread epoxy on the 1x2, kind of clamp it and fidget it in place, and then um, let that dry, um, and then remove all the clamps and, and start again. Uh, I don't use screws, or I try to avoid using screws. If Sometimes it's unavoidable, just because I'm out of clamps at that size or what have you. But for the most part, I try to rely on clamping pressure and the epoxy versus screws. Uh, I, I just think that uh, that's probably the way to go. Uh, and once again, I could be wrong, but uh, that's, that's kind of what I think. So that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to get all my clamps stationed. I'm going to start at the bow and work from bow to stern along the starboard side uh, with my 1x2s. And uh, like I said, I'm going to kind of like stage the... Uh, the clamps on the floor that way you know it's a simple matter of reaching over and, and just you know picking them up versus walking all the way to the bench and getting them um, just that little bit of prep work makes all the difference in the world uh, at least that's what I've learned so that's what we're gonna do and yeah so I'm going to station my clamps get them ready and I will uh, fill you in uh, kind of when we get closer Okay there shipmates, you can kind of see all my C-clamps are staged right next to where I'm going to be working, which is right here on the uh, starboard gunnel. So here in just a minute what I'm going to do is I'm going to mix up some thickened epoxy and I'm going to start uh, the process of attaching the uh, 1x2s, which are kind of staged right back there, to the gunnel with thickened epoxy. Uh, slightly thickened. It's not going to be overly thickened. I'm not making fillets. This is for laminating purposes. Um. <coughs> <coughs> yep, that's the last of it. But um, once we're done with that, um, hopefully I'll maybe get two good lengths, if I'm lucky, three lengths. And then that'll be it for the day. And then I'm going to have to let those dry and then carry on tomorrow moving towards the stern with uh, you doing the same process um, and that's why it's such a tedious process but on that note I just I think it's uh, the less screws you can use in doing this I think the better I also have a buddy of mine um, he's a National Guard buddy uh, he and I met at a National Guard school in Fort Leonard Wood he'll be here uh, shortly so maybe he'll uh, feel like lending a hand I'm sure he will um, uh, so we're, uh, I'll be lucky, uh, for that, but that's kind of, that's at the, that's the point we're at right now. So, um, I'm not going to get too into it. Cause like I said, when, uh, my, my buddy gets here, we'll probably start, um, kind of game planning how we're going to do this. Uh, cause just having another set of hands out here makes it all that much easier. Okay. So, uh, that's where we're at and I will, uh, talk at you here in a, in a minute. Well, as you can now see, we've got the uh, that starboard side first uh, rail of gunnel on, and uh, as indicated by all the clamps, uh, that's about our limit of advance because, frankly, we're out of clamps to do more. Um, but yeah, um, huge shout out to Trey. He really helped me out. It's always easier with somebody else. I can do it by myself, but it's a big pain in the ass. But that's that's kind of where we're at. So as you can see, guys, uh, this is probably what it's going to be like 
for like the next, oh, I don't know, week. So if I don't post a whole lot of videos, that's why. There's not a whole lot to talk about. Um, so with that being said, I'm going to uh, let you guys uh, finish enjoying your weekend. And uh, from the boat shop, uh, have a good one.